Our next inductee's nickname is Shooter, and he certainly comes by the name honestly. Over his 166 game Junior A career, he led the Ontario Lacrosse Association Junior League in scoring in both 1996 and 98, scored at a pace of nearly four and a half points per game, and led his hometown Orangeville Northmen to three Middle Cup victories in 1993, 95, and 96. Moving to the major series, he didn't skip a beat. He led the Senior A loop in scoring in three consecutive seasons, 2001 to 2003, totaled 1,452 points. Is that humming to you, or am I just hearing the humming up here? It's gone? It's because I wasn't talking. Anyway, uh, totaled 1,452 points, a pace of almost five points per game, and led Brampton to Man Cup victories in 2002, when he was the Man Cup MVP, and again in 2008 and 2009. In National Cross, in the, in National Cross League competition, he played a remarkable 19 seasons, winning the league's Champions Cup in 2005 with Toronto and 2009 with Calgary. Over that incredible pro career, he tallied 1,457 points, including 908 assists, second in NLL, NLL history, at a rate of over five points per game. Amidst all these scoring milestones, it's often overlooked that he was as tough as they come, a trait I'm sure inherited from his father, Terry. At only 5'7 and around 160 pounds, probably not that now, but he had to battle for every inch of space on the floor, and more often than not, he won those battles. He's been recognized as the most valuable player at every level in which he's played, and has been honored with membership in the Orangeville Sports Hall of Fame, the Ontario Lacrosse Hall of Fame, and the National Lacrosse League Hall of Fame. Tonight we welcome him to the Canadian Lacrosse Shine, Shrine where he joins both his late father Terry and his uncle Lindsay, Josh Sanderson. Hello everyone. I'd like to apologize for not being in attendance tonight. I'm in Aquasasne, Ontario with the San Diego Seals. We have two exhibition games that I need to be there for. I definitely am very humbled and honored to be joining all the greats in the Canadian Lacrosse Hall of Fame. And I was lucky enough to attend this event twice before, once for my dad and once last year. I'd like to congratulate all of this year's inductees, the great official Bill Fox, the great builders Ray Comier, Doug Louie, and Joanne Stagna. I'd like to congratulate all the great players joining this year's class, Rich Catton, Blaine Harrison, Trish Nicholson, Troy Ann Santos, and Caleb Toft, who I was lucky enough to play with in Calgary in 2009 and win a championship with, who's also a great friend and, and was a great teammate. I have so many people to thank for me being inducted into the Canadian Lacrosse Hall of Fame. All of my teammates from the Junior A Northmen, Brampton Excelsior, Snake Island Muskies, Coquitla Madinax, Team Canada 2011, um, you guys have your fingerprints all over me getting inducted into the Hall of Fame here tonight. To all my coaches that helped me along the way in junior, senior, pro, I can't thank you guys enough for showing the confidence in me on the floor and letting me do my thing. Um, you know, your leadership was great for me and I appreciate all of your support throughout my career. Thank you to all the equipment and physiotherapists, uh, you know, on all these teams and, and in the National Lacrosse League. You know, I just wouldn't have been able to play without all your support and help getting me ready to play each and every night. Um, you know, uh, I just can't thank you enough for your professionalism on and off the floor. So all the training staffs that I worked with uh, were phenomenal and I'm very thankful for them. You know, some special players and teammates and coaches and GMs that I played with, I just have to mention their names. Uh, they're so big as far as either chemistry on the floor or connection off the floor or just good friends that, um, you know, that I competed with and that are lifelong friends. So uh, a bit of a long list here, but Bruce Codd, Gary Scott, Jim Rankin, Rusty Kruger, Brandon Sanderson, Ryan Sanderson, Chris Sanderson, Bob Cleveley, Lindsey Sanderson, John Level, Shane Sanderson, Phil Sanderson, Troy Cordenley, Ed Gajewski, Cam Woods, Dan Teat, Mike Hazen, Shaden Santos, Aaron Wilson, Colin Doyle, Blaine Manning, 
Dan Dawson, Casey Barnes, Tracy Kaluski, Jeff Shatler, Gary Rosinski, Kurt Miloski, Scott Ranger, Dane Doby, Pat Merrill, Brody Merrill, Brandon Miller, Bob Watson, Mike Regan. I just, I just wanted to name these guys just for the comfort label they gave me and, and the chemistry we had on and off the floor um, were a very big part of my career. Um, you know, my cousin Philip was a huge part of my career, you know, just such a comfort level playing with him um, through junior, minor, senior, a bit of pro. Um, so Philip, uh, you know, always gave me that real comfort level and uh, very grateful to have a chance to play with Flip a good part of my career and, and obviously um, is a very big reason why I'm up here today. Also, my father, um, you know, he just taught me so much on and off the floor. Um, he's definitely the biggest reason why I'm joining the Hall of Fame here tonight. And, and um, I just learned so much through him throughout my career. So, um, to all the great ownerships I had uh, playing, um, Tom and Al Brandon with Brampton, Doc Hedges with Coquitlam, Orangeville Junior A Executive, Gleewood A Mitchell with Snake Island, uh, Brad Bannister with Calgary. Um, you know, I just love playing for all these teams. We were always competitive and uh, all these gentlemen uh, treated me very well. So I just wanted to thank, uh, thank all of them. Um, I was lucky enough to play on some very special teams over my career. Obviously the 1995-96 Junior A Northman will always be uh, special to me. The 2002, 8 and 09 Brampton Excelsiors will always be special. Um, the two NLL teams, uh, 2005 Toronto, 2009 Calgary, and then 2011 uh, Team Canada and Prague. Um, these teams are always going to have a special place in my heart and uh, always look fondly back on my career. Obviously, the support of the fa my family is, is one of the biggest reasons I'm up here tonight. Um, my nan, my sister, my mom were all my biggest fans, support me on and off the floor. Um, of course, my dad, who always knew what to say, off the floor too. Obviously, on the floor, he was teaching me lots, but away from the rink, I could always count on my dad to give me confidence and tell me the right things. My wife, uh, Lindsay, my son, Cameron, Dylan, and Owen, and my daughter, Ashley, I can't thank you guys enough for your support, especially near the end of my career. I loved having you guys at the games, and it helped push me probably a little bit uh, play a little bit more than I, I was going to. So um, I'm just very fortunate to be uh, putting this video up in front of you guys. Um, couldn't be happier to be joining the, the Canadian Lacrosse Hall of Fame with my father and all the greats of lacrosse. I hope everybody enjoys their evening tonight and, and thank you very much. Now, as Josh mentioned in his video, um, he is the offensive coordinator uh, and player development manager of the San Diego Seals in the NOL, and they are back east playing exhibition games. Uh, so he obviously is not able to be here tonight. But ironically, his cousin Phil, who we mentioned in the in the video, has similar responsibilities with the Vancouver Warriors. I'd like to ask Phil to come forward now and accept on Josh's behalf. <laughs> 